Good morning everybody, it is Saturday the 17th of September 2022. I'm over at um, Stanley Park to have a look at the Anfield Road Stand. Turn you around quickly to have a look. There we are, still looking huge. So yeah, we've come over to have a look at the Anfield Road Stand and to do my, my weekend voiceover video. Um, as you know, you should know the, well, I hope you know the format of these videos. By now, I've, I've I asked you all to drop me some questions um, or comments or anything. I'll pick a few out and, and go over them, anything you want me to look at. So um, we'll have a look now whilst we're walking. So first one, um, I'll pop it up on the screen. First one, um, Glenn Gates. Great work, Mr. Drone. Love watching the progress each week. Quick question for the next video. Can you look at the plant open areas below the top of the main stand versus Anfield Road stands? you look at the plant open areas below the top of the main stand Anfield Road stand the still supports appear to be almost twice the length on the Anfield Road than the main stand wonder why they didn't make them identical looking okay um, yeah okay I'll have another look at that when we're up there so there's the first one um, next one slow typer um, at 2 minutes 28 of the last video it looks like they're preparing some more roof terrace on the left hand side um, the roof underneath the seat terracing okay um, I'm sure it'll make more sense when I'm up in the air that should allow any spills to be put in place ready for the next seat terracing and backspan okay left hand side so I think when you say left hand side you must mean up by the um, Kenny Dog Leash end and the Anfield Road end so yeah we'll have a look at that um, Philip Fell, this is a nice one I like. Um, I'd actually love to see a video where you point out the location of Bramley Dock so you can see where it is in connection with the two, with the current two grounds. Love seeing Goodison in the shots. Yeah, I'm going to do that. Um, there's um, someone else has said that. Ian Lamont. Is it possible to see Bramley Moor Dock in the background of any of the aerial shots? So yes, we would have a look at that. And then last one, um, William Wilcock. Would you take a close look at what they're constructing on the terracing at the moment? Not sure if it's a temporary structure or whether it's to be lifted, thanks. Yes, okay, so we got all them coming up. Let's get the drone up in the air and have a look. Let's go. Okay, guys, so here we go. Um, go straight up. Get up quite high, get up to about uh, 90 metres because I think the first question that, that I'm going to cover, um, or the first comment, needs to be quite high um do you know what it's absolutely lovely morning for uh for drone lovely morning anyway but especially for for drone and there's hardly any wind at all really clear um it's a bit chilly though a bit cold hence you might have seen at the beginning i've got my um full trachean body warmer on i haven't had to do that for a while we're gonna get round to the back so you see the uh, the yellow lights on the pitch as well. Um, in one of my voiceovers, I just as I was talking, I said they were watering the pitch with them. Of course they're not, and I did actually know that. It's just kind of when you when you're doing it live and everything, um, just kind of talk and, and say things that <laughs> sometimes isn't exactly right. Then that's not watering the pitch. That's giving it um, giving the pitch some at, um, artificial light to to help it grow in areas. And the reason they do that is because the stands cover um you'll see mostly they do it like in the corners or on the edges it won't so much be in the middle it's because the stands cover and um, block out the the sunlight getting to it um right so we're here we're here kind of up in position now and let, let's take a look at this uh this question again i'm just going to hold it there while i um bring the the comments up so yeah let's go comment from uh glenn glenn gates it was Great work, Mr. Love watching the progress each week. Quick question for next video. Can you look at the plant open areas below the top of the main stand versus the Anfield Road stands? The still support appear to be almost twice the length on the Anfield Road than the main stand. Um, wonder why they didn't make identical looking. Okay, let's... I think... Um, I think, Glenn. Glenn, thanks very much for your, for your comments. Let, let's get up high. So, going up to... 100 and 115 meters here let's go down I, I might need you to, to to point out a bit more Glenn to be honest because I'm not sure 
exactly what you mean. So let's just have a, have a look at the steel supports. Uh, when you say steel supports, I'd like to know, Glenn, if you mean like the the front spans. So I'm, I'm over it here, um, looking at the... So right below us, we've got the, the Anfield Road stand, as we know, being developed. And then there's the, the main stand. There, so when you say steel supports, Glenn, could you see the, the front spans coming out? Um, let's go, let's have a look at this, go in this corner. Said on the Anfield Road stand, they're almost twice the length. Yeah, I'll, I'll, you know, I'll take a good look at it there. But I'm not, I'm going to be honest, I'm not 100% what you mean um, I'm really sorry really sorry um, the to me that the front spans if you look at the the main stand roof um, coming out where it comes out the the front bit it look I think that looks just like what the what the front spans look like on the Anfield Road stand um, but like I say I, I'm just not I'm just not 100% what you mean um, Glenn, could you could you clarify for me, and I'll I'll take another look at that. And like I say, anybody else that might have an idea, um, but they, we're, I'm having a look at it there for you, um, Glenn, to see if that that helps that helps you kind of figure out. But from what I'm looking at there, um, I think it it does look. Um, just looking again, the steel support appears to be almost twice the length from the Anfield Road than the main stand. No, I, I, I think it looks all similar. Um, anyway, do you know what? I'm going to move on uh, from that. I've had a look at it there, Glenn and everybody else. If anybody, you know, spots, spots you know what, what Glenn means there, please drop me drop me comments. I'll, I'll happily have a look at that again um, for you. I'm sorry if I couldn't, uh, couldn't clarify more. Um, right, let, let's just uh, move on to slow typer. It looks like they're preparing for some more roof terracing on the left side. Left hand side, the roof underneath the seat terracing. Um, the roof underneath the seat terracing. That should allow any stills to be put in place ready for the next still terracing and backspan. Looks like they're preparing for some more roof terracing on the left hand side. Um, right, so I'll go and have a look. I'll go over to the left hand side. I think this might um, actually might cover like William Wilcox. We're going to put Williams up as well. Could you take a, look, a close look at what they're constructing on the terracing at the moment? Not sure if it's a temporary structure or whether it's to be lifted. So right, I'm going to have a, I'm going to go over, over it right now. Um, in fact, we will. I'm going to come round this way because I'm going to keep in mind Glenn's question as well um, of what what Glenn asked because we might still be able to to see what he means covering it. So right, have a look at what they're, so the left hand side, I'm assuming when you say left hand side, um, you mean from the, looking from the back of it, which from there, from here would be the right hand side. Um, so you're saying they're constructing something on the terracing. Let's have a little zoom. Uh, they are, yeah, yeah. I see. Uh, take me, take me down a bit. I'm still um, 95 meters up here, guys. Um, is he scaffolding in there? Just going up to 95. I'm going to go right over. There we go, yeah, see exactly what you mean. Um, there you can see, they, uh, there is some like, um, looks like there's scaffold and some bits on it. Um, I mean, as you know, I can, I can take a look at it. So this is more uh, Williams, I think, um, taking a close look at the, what they're constructing on the terrace and at the moment. So yeah, there you go. I mean, I, I can take a look at it. Can't tell you what it is. Um, can't tell you whether it's to be lifted or not. I'm assuming they're 
Maybe it's the um, maybe it's the f the frames that go round those, you know, around the entrances to the stand, like the walkways, um, the tunnels, or something. I'm, but obviously, I I don't I don't know um, what it is. And slow typer, does this cover yours as well? It looks like they're preparing some more roof terrace on the left hand side, the roof underneath the seat terracing. Should allow any stairs to be put in place. I'll have a I'll have a look in a minute, but I think this this definitely covers um, covers yours, um, William. About looking at what they're doing on the terracing. Yeah, don't know exactly what, but there it is. Anyone who knows, um, can you can you let us know, please? <clears throat> Anyone that might have a have a clue at what they're what they're doing there, what that's for. Um, good spot, good spot, William. So now let's see what if I come back, I'll come back this way. Let's see if I can get a kind of nice shot. And look, it's going really bright now. And what I'm going to do, I'm going to come out around the Kenny Dog Leash. Wait, I'm losing signal because I've I've gone and walked up too close to the um, to the Anfield Road and the back of it. So I'm almost standing right right underneath it, and then expecting my my drone to um, to keep signal. Right, they're moving around to this side now. I want to move around here for, for a couple of reasons. So, I want to go back to, to Glenn's question about the the size of the, the steel supports difference. Um, Glenn, I, I think, looking at the, the main stand and the Anfield Road stand, I personally think it, it does look quite... You know, like like they're using the same sort of um, spans there, but like I say, I, I could, sorry, I'm gonna have to zoom out. I'm still zoomed right in. Um, yeah, I, I'm sorry, mate. You're gonna have to to let me know exactly what you mean from that. Um, and guys, if I've got if I had any any of the wrong uh, positions for any of your questions, I obviously know William. I was looking at the the right one. Um, looking directly at the at the stand and what was being constructed um, on on the terracing, um, but I'm not sure um, if I've covered slow typer. Uh, when you say it looks like they're preparing for some more roof terrace on the left hand side, um, you know, is is that what you meant? Did you mean on on there as well? Because you did put the roof underneath the seat terracing. So, um, and Glenn, like I say, can you can you just clarify? I hope I covered it. I hope so. Um, so lastly, I'm going to look at um, Philip Fell, um, who says, I'd actually love to see a video where you point out the location of Bramley Docks so you can see where it is in connection to the two current grounds. Love to see, love seeing Goodison in the shots. And we, I also add um, Ian Lamont saying, is it possible to see Bramley Dock site in the background of any aerial shots? So here we are. We are over the Sir Kenny Dog Leash stand area. And if we look in the distance, if you go... Right over the corner. I'll point it out on, on my uh, when I'm doing the editing. But you can see four cranes. If you go to the coast, um, you can see like New Brighton in the in the distance. Go along the coast, you can see a couple of wind um, uh, wind turbines um, there. Um, if you go along from say the red cranes at the very right, um, at Seaforth, go along. You count four wind turbines, and then you see four cranes all together. Um, Yeah, then you see four cranes all together. I'm going to get them right in the middle of my shot there. And I'm going to zoom just so you know exactly kind of where we're looking at. There, the four cranes in the middle. That's Bramley Moor. Um, that's Bramley Moor Dock there. Let me zoom back out. And let's 
C. Okay, there's the corner of Goodison. So let me get, especially for for you guys that asked. Let's get all three in one shot. How far am I going to have to to come round for that? I'm not sure. Yeah, that's that's a tough shot to get. Sorry, guys. Um, the edge of Goodison there to the right. Uh, the edge of well, you see Anfield, and then the very distance you see Bramley Moor. Um, let me take a photo. I've taken it back a bit there to get all of Goodison in, um, <laughs> and it's still not in. But I am like 550 meters away. Um, so yeah, there you go. There you there you see them all. Um, for you guys that ask, so gonna bring. Gonna bring myself back in now, I think. Okay, guys, there you go. Um, so, yeah, I, I tried to 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 cover um, those those questions. Um, sorry, I'm just uh, put my phone back on so I can go over them again. I tried to cover those questions best I could. I've got to keep this end bit um, as short as I can because. Like I've said, when, when you get up there and you're talking, honestly, it goes so quick. I think we were up to, like, I think it might be 15 minutes or so, and I apologise for that. It just goes so quick when you're talking. I had a couple of other things to cover as well. Um, somebody asked a question specifically about drones. Um, I'm going to cover that next time. Um, but I meant to this time, but I didn't because I didn't get time. I had to get it down. Anyway, Glenn Gates, thanks very much for your, your question and, and comments. Um, please, can you comment again for me and just, just, just point out what you mean because i i think those those steel supports do look the same but um i might have i might have n not understood what you meant um so apologies if i didn't um let me know please um slow typer um yeah we i think i covered it i think i had a look i think you might have been talking about the um the same thing as um william wilcock i think um so we had a look at what they were what they're building actually on the terracing um I'm not sure what it is, but we had a look at it. Um, they're definitely building something there. Anybody that knows, drops a comment. Uh, really grateful. And then um, I had Ian Lamont and um, who was it? Philip Fell. Uh, Ian Lamont and Philip Fell, who asked to see um, Bramley Moor Dock in the distance. Where is it? I've pointed that out. And they asked to see Goodison. So to do the, the Goodison one, um, I had to like... <laughs> I was... Oh dear, just dropped my phone. Um, I was like 500 metres over that way um which is right over the right over you know the where, whereabouts will that be like tubrook way something like that um yeah so um yeah anyway um i got it i got the shots i hope you enjoyed it um so any please any questions um any questions any comments uh please let me know down below really appreciate them and i will get over i will have a look every saturday um or well hopefully you know um weather depending that's my plan to come over and just cover any questions um the saturday ones are not and not just to to look at the site i do that every wednesday we have a good look at the site and what's going on flying around it um the saturday ones are to just answer any questions and look at any comments you've got okay um so i hope you enjoyed that um i might not have covered them exactly but i i tried i went up and, and tried and um if i didn't understand your question let me know um i'll have a look at it again Thanks everyone. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. Please like, share, subscribe. Really appreciate your subscriptions and your likes and your comments. Please keep them coming. If you want to buy me a beer, you can do so here. I need to shut up. The video's gone on too long. Thanks everyone. Take care. Bye now.